Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And I made a video yesterday about rounding corners on an alligator. And the gentleman had X5, and I don't have X5. And, I, and a viewer, and a really good guy that's helped me out before, told me it was called Filet Scallop and Champer in X5. Well, I started looking. So let's do this. Apply, and that's what it does. It rounds off the corners of, of an object or a curve. But in 19, it is under Docker Corners. But in anything below, this is 18. In anything below, it's under Docker's Filet, Scallop, and Champer. I don't know why Corel would change that. It does do the corners, so they're making it maybe more correct. But they do confuse some people. So if you want to round the corner of an object, and just for instance, on a star, you have to just click it and around the corners. Now, if you want to round, just to make the video a little bit better, if you want to round the inside corners, you can round the inside corners. Well, they are rounding, but not very much. So if you want to round just this one corner, just select it with the shape tool. And you can't go 12, but let's go 2. And it's too big. Let's go 0 0.05. Let's back up here. Tell you what, let's get a new star. Once you've done something, it kind of messes things up. So let's select those inner... We need to convert it to a curve. Select those inner corners and round them. See how they're rounded? Let's back up here and round them a little more. Let's go 0.5. So if you, well, it's doing all the corners because I didn't select. So if you select the inner corners, it'll just do the inner corners. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.